don't team drive with your trainee. You know, let your trainee teach your trainee how to operate the truck from the passenger seat. Actually, be involved in your trainee's training. Just because your trainee knows how to drive a truck does not mean that he does not want you up there training him. And just because you see your trainee can, can drive the truck doesn't mean that you should say, okay, I'm going to the sleeper and go to sleep. All right, so I've been sitting on this clip for a while. Uh, you may recognize it. It's a small excerpt from the clip uh, that I made the video about Derek, the worst trainer ever video. I'll put a link to that down below. Check that out. That's Derek Bowie's story of the worst trainer ever. It's Derek Bowie, not this Derek. But anyway, when I when I record this clip, I knew I wanted to make a video about it. I just didn't know exactly what kind of video I wanted to make. Well, I think I kind of got it figured out now. So let's talk about it. Anyway, guys, before we get into it, um, here's a little sneak peek for kind of the direction some of my videos may start going. That's right, yo. Your boy got a GoPro. What's up? Gonna start changing the game up. May put a little bit more vlog style stuff in here. Gonna knock that loser trucker owl off the map. Fuck that guy. So anyway, enough of that uh, getting off subject stuff. Um, so basically what I wanted to talk about was um, kind of like a call to, to trainers and stuff. Uh, basically, if you don't want to be a trainer to train people, to make people better, then don't, don't fucking do it, man. Find a different way to make money. If, like, your only intention in training is to use a student to make money, then you're not doing anybody any kind of service. You know what I mean? And I get it. The money's good. Believe me, I know. But, like, my passion wasn't training. So I don't train anymore. I still, you can ask any of my students, still taught all of them stuff. Shit. People I teamed with, I try to teach stuff to. I try to learn stuff from people. I'm not bold enough to even think that I'm experienced enough to even be a trainer. But they gave me the chance to make some money. So I fucking did it. Uh, but no, I mean, this is a bad trend that I've been seeing a lot of where people are complaining about their trainers and stuff. And maybe some of it's the students. Maybe the students suck. I get that. But, if, but it's more stories than not of students having crappy trainers. Trainers that use them to make money. So yeah, shitty trainers, I'm talking to you. Go the fuck on somewhere, man. Go lease a fucking truck from Prime. Go team somewhere that's not CR England. Uh, I mean, I'm here at CFI teaming. And I'm making $1,400, bucks a week. I mean, there's good money to be made out there without uh, fucking ruining the people's experiences and training. And then you put these dudes out there on the road and they fucking suck and then... They give your company a bad name. And it's not their fault because they weren't fucking trained. Or they were trained by somebody like that doesn't know anything. So, trainers, fucking do better. And trainers, believe me, I get it. Some of these students fucking suck. But if you don't have the passion enough to gut through it and try to teach somebody something, then you probably shouldn't be a trainer. That was my thing. Why I quit being a trainer was I just got tired of dealing with it and it just wasn't for me. But if you have a passion for it and you want to teach people, don't let anybody talk you out of it. Be a trainer. Teach this next generation how to be truck drivers because we need you guys. We need you trainers. You know, it's not for everybody. And some people that are doing it, they probably shouldn't. And I hope they get weeded out eventually. Uh, there's so many other ways to make money in trucking than training when you have no business training. So, if you're out there using your students just to make money, 
if you're out there team driving with them saying hey just keep between the lines and wake me up when we get to the shipper well then fuck you because you're not doing that student justice you're not doing your company justice you just you're wasting time and uh that's why people end up learning more from their teammates when they get to their truck or they learn more from watching people in the truck stop parking lots they learn more like that than they do from you and you fucking suck and you know enjoy your money I guess but just what cost did it come to make it I mean fuck you guys uh but anyway guys that's gonna about do it for this video I appreciate y'all tuning in I will catch y'all on the next one peace hey guys make sure you subscribe to the channel like the video and comment down below. I love getting your comments. I always respond to them. And I appreciate any interaction with the video. Thanks, guys. Talk to you all next time.